we've uh, conducted this 28-month investigation where when we were being criticized and, and people saying you're not doing anything, we were, we were investigating it. So then once, once the, uh, uh, the charges, the investigation, the arrest, the jail time, you can't stop there because you see that culture might continue. And what's different this time, what's different with my administration as Secretary of State, is that we are getting back into the county. You know, this particular county lost its county clerk, uh, a county sheriff, and a county commissioner. And we are just not being over with that. Just because they were sentenced to uh, federal prison time, we are in that county helping them to make sure they understand the process and make sure they're following the law. And that's a huge difference. We've seen it from the May primary election, that we are there and the citizens see that there can be an honest election with that collapse collaboration that we talk about. What specifically are you doing? You say you're in the counties. What are all the things that you're doing with them? Well, what, what, we've, what we started out doing was um, making sure that their voter list and their voter registration cards were in proper order and that making sure that, that voters were put correctly on um, uh, an active role, an inactive role, or a canceled role. So that, that was number one. Because what what kind of state were they in? It, it was in a... Um, a poor state. It, it was because in some places they didn't know where all of the cards were. So that's that's the start. That's a basis there. And we were there during the voting period. There's early voting in West Virginia and obviously on election day. And we're, we're giving confidence. We're giving courage to election workers and the county clerk by simply also being there when someone wants to take in a, a voter and say, well, this voter needs assistance. No, they don't. They can read. And it's, it's, it's being there and, and giving the courage to a poll worker to say, no, Mrs. Smith, you can't go in with Mr. Jones because you, we know that you can read and that won't be tolerated anymore. And, and quite simply, when people have said to us, well, that's the way we've always done it here, our simple response is not anymore. So you were basically holding their hands to show them how to run a clean election. Yes, and, and, and what I see out of this particular county, too, is they're going to be the standard. If they can keep it and they can show that we're going to follow the books, we're going to follow state code when it comes to elections, and you know, you, you may need assistance from time to time, and, and that's what we do. We can get them on the right track and, and be part to, to help them at the same time.